Hello, boys and girls, my name is Otto C, and welcome back to another episode of the No Sleep Challenge. As you can see from the Shining Armor, armor uh, we are enchanted uh, all the way with uh, Protection 4, Unbreaking 3, Mending and Feather Falling on the Boots, as well as a pretty decent uh, sword. Uh, and a bow. So I also gathered up quite a few uh, emeralds um, because the next thing we need is um, ender pearls. And there are different ways we can get them. Uh, one way is by trading with uh, clerics. Uh, they have a 66% chance uh, of ender pearls on the fourth level. And yeah, we had a thunderstorm with some uh, some skelly horses. So. We need to find another villager, uh, village, um, and hope that they have a cleric there. Uh, the other option uh, is uh, going to the nether and doing a bit of uh, bartering. Ah, there is another village. Uh, or in a uh, warped forest there are a lot of uh, endermen so slaying a few of those uh, would hopefully uh, result in some uh, in some ender pearls we already have three uh, However, I did not slay a single enderman. They were all killed by uh, golems as they uh, wandered in the uh, in the village. But this one apparently has no church, which means no cleric. So let's wander off. Oh, there is an. Uh, Outpost, we want to avoid that, but let's wander over here. I had hoped that there might be um, another village uh, in this plains biome. But it does not look like uh, the village is that big. So uh, let's head back to our boat. Ah, that one over there looks more like uh, a church tower. So let's turn around and head for the village at the other side of the shore and it looks like it is built up a mountain slope uh, that's that's cool to see so let's hop on here and search out the uh the cleric is in here um, yeah we will trade our rotten flesh we do not have that much then just enough redstone for you to level up where are you going I'm not done with you uh, I also have a bit of gold Uh, yeah, the gold, that's bigger steps. 
Uh, however, we might then need to go dig for some more gold. Uh, as I don't have any rabbit food, uh, let's buy a few uh, of these uh, uh, glowstone and hope that you have ender pearls. And of course, you have not. You have not. Um, so, what we will do, we will not be nice, um, we will block this off, and then you have to die, because we need the um the brewing stand head over to the next villager okay and do the same thing again All right Ooh, only two gold ingots. Okay. Yes, you have ender pearls. Um. We need, worst case, 12 eyes of end for the frame. Then we need a few more um, to find the stronghold. And then it's good to have a few more um, on the side. So you are uh, traded up. Um, have you restocked? Yes. So let's exhaust our uh, our uh, uh, our emerald supply and uh, get all the all the ender pearls that we need. Right. So next stop, uh, we need uh, end rods so we can make um, the eyes of ender but we will do that um, by creating the uh, um, nether portal uh, what i'm talking about we don't need end rods we need blaze rods uh, and with the blaze powder uh, we can create the eyes of ender but we will create the uh, the nether portal at our uh, spawn base. Um, so we will head over there. Um, I think I collected everything from there that I need. Yeah, so let's head back to the spawn base and jump into the nether. And we are back. So let's go on and uh, let's put a few things away first. We don't need that boat anymore. Um, uh, well, maybe we can use that in the nether. Uh, let's also put the ender pearls away safely. Um, we need um, some gold armor. So let's switch out the uh, the 
boots uh, because that's the easiest or the, the, the armor piece that requires uh, the less um, pieces of gold. So, and let's do the nether portal here. Three high. And right, um, yeah, let's also be prepared. Um, so, want some building blocks on here, uh, just in case we encounter a ghast on the nether side. Right. Oh, we are in a crimson forest, which is a tiny bit dangerous uh, because there are these uh, these monsters. Oh, the babies are not too bad, so let's head over here. And here we should be safe. Um, just don't look any uh, Enderman in the eye. Uh, we need to find a nether fortress. So let's have a look around. This is all closed off. And over there, I do not see anything in that direction. So we are, by the way, uh, on day uh, 89. So we are still uh, under 100 days. Uh, but let's take a tool tunnel and this direction gives us a bit of uh, netherrack that we can use to uh, to build out and seeing that we do not yet have an uh, Elytra. Hopefully this will we will not end up here uh, over open uh, over an open lava pit. Okay, um, maybe change directions a tiny bit. Have a look out here. Uh, yeah, so let's go a bit more in this direction. And Yep, yeah, this looks nice. We can have a staircase down here. And do I have torches? Yes. Um, so let's mark it this way. So we know where the uh, entry is. And seeing that we have golden shoes on they are okay with us so let's look around and find that nether fortress while well, not stepping into fire 
print portal over there cannot see anything in that direction so let's hop up here and <coughs> Shall I dare opening this chest? There are no piglins nearby and nothing good in it. Um, souls and valley over there, lots of skellies and what's worse, um, uh, probably um, lots of uh, Gas spawning there. So let's bridge over here and head in this direction. More soul sand valley over here. It. On, of course, on here are incredibly slow. Uh, walking on so soil is a bit faster. On the soul sand. Nice! Two shot bow. One shot bow. Occasionally. Luckily for us, still no gas. But no fortress either. So, I would say let's call this episode um, a done deal. Um, I will try to locate um, a nether fortress until the next time and then we shall see how we fare in it. Until then, goodbye. Like this. <laughs>